kids, and we get to learn about this awesome transformation. Ooh. This guy even gets his name changed. Whoa, yeah. that's cool. His name was Saul, and then it turns to Paul. Well, I can't wait to learn about Saul, who's now Paul. <laughs> that's so much fun. But first, we have a memory verse. So, Corinne, what's yes, the memory verse? Yes, we do. Verse? All right, friends, come join us. We're going to have so much fun today. Uh -huh. All right, put your hands up. Put yeah. my hands up. Mm -hmm. Touch your hands like that. Touch so, my hands like this. Jesus, Jesus is, is the same, same yesterday, yesterday, today, and forever. Hebrews 13, 8. Hmm, Miss Carissa, I mm -hmm. just want to tell everyone that memory verse. Do you think we could shout it? I love to shout. You do? I'm so happy you said that. She okay. loves shouting. Ah! Okay, let's do this. All right. Jesus, Jesus is the, the same, same yesterday, today, and forever. Hebrews 13, 8. Yes! It's so good. They did so good. And now we're ready because we've got on our loud voices. We get to sing to Woo! Jesus. So, on three, one, two, three. Oh, I know God made me, and I know God loves me, and he knows what's best for me, cause he knows every single thing. And I believe his promise is true, cause everything he says he will do. On a Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, God. In 
makes me wanna wanna move my feet. Hey. It makes me wanna wanna spin around and see. It makes me wanna wanna move my feet. Hey. It makes me wanna wanna spin around and see. Everybody say. Another Bible story, and I am so excited to do it with you today. It's about a guy that really changed. Can you say change? Change. That's right. That's when one thing goes from something completely different to another thing. And that's what he did. He even had his name change from Saul to Paul. Good job. That's right. From Saul to Paul. All right, let's go find Chipper. Chipper! Chipper! Chipper, what do you have today? He has something in his mouth. It was a butterfly. Good job, Chipper. You know, if anything changes, it's a butterfly, right, Chipper? Mm-hmm. Butterflies go from just being a little worm to then becoming a bigger worm, and then they become a cocoon, and they're stuck inside of this little tiny space, and then they emerge, what? A beautiful butterfly, huh, Chipper? Yeah, it reminds us of the guy in our story today, huh? Mm-hmm, how he changed. He completely changed, just like a butterfly completely changes. God takes us and Jesus takes us and he changes us, doesn't he, Chipper? That's right. Thank you so much for bringing that, Chipper. Now it's time to read it from the Bible story, right? All right, are you ready to say Bible? Bible. <laughs> Let's sing our Bible song. The B-I-B-L-E. Yes, that's the book for me. I stand alone on the word of God. The B-I-B-L-E. Bible. Good job, Chipper. All right. Bye, Chipper. Thanks for bringing us that beautiful butterfly. Chipper really has a way of finding things that go along with our story, huh? Yeah, he's so good at that. Oh, wow. Here's our Bible story for today. Blind faith. 
Ananias helps Paul see. Wow, there's even more to our story than I thought. Christians were afraid of Paul. Paul tracked them down and threw them in prison. Wow, you know, Saul really didn't seem like a good guy, did he? Not somebody I would want to know, because you know what? I'm a Christian. Are you a Christian? Are you a Jesus follower? Saul wouldn't like you very much. In fact, he would even put you in prison just for being a Christian. When Paul was on his way to arrest more Christians, a blinding light flashed from heaven and a voice boomed. Paul, I am Jesus. Stop hurting my friends. Wow, Jesus really stepped in for us, didn't he? He told Paul that he cannot hurt any more of his people and his Christians. Suddenly, Paul couldn't see. His friends led him into the city, and for three days, Paul waited and prayed for the Lord. You know, that's what Jesus did. He made him so that he couldn't even see anything. Then Jesus sent Ananias to help Paul. God wants you to receive the Holy Spirit. Ananias explained. Immediately, Paul could see again. Paul told everyone, Jesus really is God's son. So Paul was a guy who didn't believe in Jesus. And Jesus transformed his life to show him that he is real. And at the end of it, he said, Jesus really is God's son. And we know that to be true, don't we? Jesus really is God's son. And Jesus changes us. Can you say that with me? Jesus changes us. That's right. So friends, let's get those markers and pencils and paper, and let's see what Corinne is gonna color today. to see Korean color. Hi friends, I'm so excited you joined us today. Did you know that that story we just heard comes from the Bible and every story in the Bible is true. So Paul's name used to be Saul and Saul hated Jesus. But then one day God spoke to Saul and said, why are you hurting my friends? And he closed Saul's eyes for a while, but then he sent someone to help Saul and they prayed together and God opened Saul's eyes, turned him into Paul and showed him that, hey, Jesus is really my son. And so Paul realized that God's son was Jesus. Isn't that so awesome? Mm -hmm. That God could open his eyes and change his heart. I love our God, don't you? Now, friends, do you know what time it is? It's time to color. So I have my piece of paper and I have my markers. And today, we're gonna draw some ice. That's right, cause Saul's eyes were closed. He couldn't see for three days. But then God sent someone to help Saul, turned him into Paul, and opened his eyes to the fact that Jesus was his son. So we're gonna draw some eyes. So let's get started. To start, I'm gonna draw two circles, okay? Cause we have two eyes. So I'm gonna draw one circle right here and then another one right here, okay? So draw your first circle, okay, friends? There you go, one circle. Now we're gonna draw a second one right next to it, okay? And that's okay if they don't look exactly alike. Look, mine are lopsided. <laughs> now, for our eyes, we're gonna draw two more circles in each eye. That's four circles, okay? So you're gonna draw a big circle right here. And then you're gonna draw a smaller one inside of it, okay? And the smaller one, I want you to color it in, okay? 
So let's see, we've drawn one, two, three circles, so many. All right, and I'm coloring in my last circle, okay? So look, we have one eye, two eyes, and each eye has one, two, three circles. That means we just drew six circles. Hmm, those eyes look a little funny. I don't know where they're looking at, huh? Can I see your eyes though? Hold them up. Oh, good job, friends. Oh, where are your eyes looking? <laughs> Never know, that's so funny. Don't you just love drawing, friends? <gasps> Did you hear that? <gasps> it's prayer time. You wanna know what I love even more than drawing? Prayer time. So how about we go find Miss Carissa and we can all pray together. Okay, can you help me find her? Put your hands right here and go, Miss Carissa. All right, good job, friends. Now let's do it for real. Miss Carissa. Miss Carissa. Miss Corinne. Miss Carissa. Miss Corinne. Miss, Miss Carissa. Oh, Miss Carissa. oh, oh hey, hey Miss Corinne. Hi. 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 You Guess know, what? What? It's prayer time. I love prayer time. So you know why? 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 You can pray anytime, anywhere, about anything. Uh, can we say that one more time? Uh huh. You can, you can pray, pray anytime, anywhere, anywhere about anything. anything. So, can we pray right now? Mm-hmm. I want to play right now. So do you I. You know what else? I like to pray before I go to bed. <gasps> That's a good time. I like to pray before I eat. <gasps> that sounds like an even better time. And I also like to pray when I'm in my car. Ooh, I'm in my car a lot. I should try that. Mm -hmm. I like mm -hmm. to pray in my car. So maybe you guys could try that too this week, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. why not? But let's pray right now. Right now. All right, close your eyes, fold your hands. Dear God, thank you so much for our story today, how you even changed Paul's name. God, you wanna come and change us and make us different people, even so much as to change our names. So God, I pray that you would come and change us this week. Make us more like you. We love you, Jesus, because we know that you love us. And all God's kids said, Amen! Amen. Guess what? What? I think it's craft time. You're right. It is. Okay, show me, Miss Corinne. All right, ready, friends? Yes. Look. Oh, he's so oh. angry. That was Ooh. Saul. But then Can you Jesus... guys do an angry voice? But then Jesus came. Whoop. He closed his eyes. Close your <gasps> eyes. We can't see anything. I can't see anything. Paul I couldn't can't see anything. The craft. No, where'd the craft go? Maybe we should open our eyes. Okay, let's open our eyes. Look, his eyes are closed. But it didn't end there. Jesus opened his eyes and turned him into Paul. And a happy face too, happy right? Happy face. Oh, you guys are so good at making those happy faces. I love mm -hmm. seeing those. But I think that's all we have for today, so. 